Close your eyes and try to stay with the breath. Watch the breath all the way in, all the way out. Notice when you breathe in how far does it go down in the body. The air may go only as far as the lungs, but the sense of breathing energy can actually go all the way down to your feet. So try to be present for how the breathing feels in the body. When you're totally present like this, the mind doesn't have much opportunity to slip off. It's when the mind is in a very narrow compass, in a very narrow area, that it can slip off. But here you've got your awareness in your hands, in your feet, everywhere. It's hard for it to slip away. This way the mind can be, be cool and settle down. It's the mind that spins a lot, that creates a lot of heat. In John Lee's image is of an electric, electric generator. It spins and spins and spins and creates a lot of heat inside. And for the most part, our mind goes spinning around in things that really don't accomplish much. There's gain, but then there's loss. There's status, there's loss of status, there's pleasure, pain, praise, criticism. <clears throat> These things come and go. We put so much effort into getting the good side, and we get really disappointed disappointed when the bad side comes. Now this doesn't mean there's nothing that's worth putting your energy into. The Buddha was not a defeatist. He actually called his path the path of unexcelled victory. He says there's something that really is worthwhile putting out an effort for. And that's the end of suffering. In this path that we follow, we have generosity, we have virtue, we have the meditation. It all aims in that direction. These are all worthwhile acts. So the effort that goes into these things is effort well spent. But so much of our effort just gets wasted in other things. So it's good to give the mind a place where it can stay and rest, so that when it doesn't have to be thinking about things, it can find some strength inside, find some coolness inside. So this is a skill that everyone should have. Because we live in a world that requires a lot of spinning. We've been spinning around in things that really don't pay back. They give us a little something, and then they take it away. But here's something when you focus your efforts here. Okay, they go straight to something really good. And part of that skill is the skill of learning how to keep the mind still, to see clearly and to have a sense of well-being inside. So work on this stillness. As for the other spinning that's going on in the mind, just let it go. You can stay right here, because the good things are right here.